contents were light and were no larger than an envelope. The contents were probably genius invocation cards. We've run into Kirara multiple times throughout our trip. We came to Inazuma because we tracked the thief here. No, that doesn't seem to be the answer. No. No. No, that doesn't seem to be the... No, that doesn't seem to be the answer. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be any more leads. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be any more leads. Hmm. There doesn't s The thief is likely using Comania Express to send packages. Kirara's deliveries contain the treasure chest card backs. Yes! You nailed it! Huh? So the card backs we've been looking for have been right under our noses all along? But there's still one thing that doesn't quite add up. Kirara picked up her package in Mondstadt before we encountered the card snatcher. The timing doesn't make sense. I've thought about that, too. The way I see it, there's more than just one thief involved. Yes, the person you've been tracking most likely is one member of the group. It seems the other members had already obtained the cardbacks and sent them together. Hmm, now that I think about it, collecting all those cardbacks across so many nations would be near impossible for just one person. But... Why isn't the one we're following ever using Komania Express? Because he's too slow. He probably missed the arranged shipment date. Well, that's how I figure it at least. From your explanation, he's only committed theft on one occasion, and there were even witnesses. After that, he's been trading or playing to collect the card backs. I suspect that this person isn't a very good thief. He probably used the mora he was given to arrange shipments with Comania Express as funds to use for trading. And there's another question now. Why don't the other members just keep the cards and take them back to Samaru themselves? Unless there's a reason for them to stay. Yes, this is a question I'm still grappling with now. What is the thief's objective? What kind of secret is hidden behind these card backs? Unfortunately, there's no way to know without seeing one for ourselves. Uh, uh, hey, don't look at me like that. I can't just open a customer's parcel. If the company ever found out, I'd be fired on the spot. And I don't want to go back to being a yokai in the mountains of Inazuma. No, we don't want to cause you any trouble, of course. At this point, maybe it would be best for you all to accompany Kirara to Sumeru. Good idea. Going to the delivery location is the only lead worth following now. And if the recipient really is a bad guy, then Karara could be in danger. We should come along to make sure you're safe. Hey, I know my way around a fight too. I haven't had a single package stolen from me since I've started this job. Whenever someone picks on me thinking I'd be an easy target to take packages from, I send them running. Uh, let me think about it. All right, I'll let you come with me to the delivery point in Sumeru. But on one condition. 
You have to promise that you'll hide somewhere where the customer can't see you. Who's ever heard of a group of people delivering packages? No problem. You got it. Also, even if the customer is a bad guy and has stolen things, we should leave that for the local authorities to handle. Next stop, Sumeru! Oh, we're really traveling all over the place this time. Good luck. You'll have to tell me how everything turns out the next time we meet. General Kujo, could I have a word with you? Yes. Congratulations on your victory, Sangonomiya Kokomi. I wanted to express my gratitude for the helpful advice you provided before the match. It was nothing. Anyone with a good head on their shoulders knows that skill and strategy ultimately determine the winner. In any case, it was an exciting match to watch. It was unfortunate that you didn't register for the tournament as well. I'm afraid I'd be no match for you. Don't say that. You're not so different from me. Seeking chances to hone your skills in the game, considering countermeasures, and competing with others as if they're friends? Perhaps you have a point. In that case, let's play a match of Genius Invocation before you depart for Narukami Island. It would be my pleasure. Whoa! That match between Fox Lady and Fish Lady really got my blood racing. The sweat's practically boiling off my forehead. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm sure all of Rito knows how excited you are, but the gang's all waiting for us. We should be heading back now. Eh, they can wait a little longer. At least let my compadre and I play one last match. You can't say no to that. Pretty please? That's my compadre. I knew you'd be down to duel. Only you understand a hardcore TCG player like me. Ugh, seriously, what will I do with you two?